Hey, no man. Oh, nice. Maybe don't mean to stop. Raccoon been only playing top players for like a month now. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, nice. What did you do, violate? What's going on? Oh, come on. Bro, I hate his uh, wall throw. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh crap. Yeah, that was a good option. At least for time's sake. Yeah, the okie doke. Yeah, face down, head towards. Get up for. Works against everybody. Yo, nice launch punish. <laughs> oh, nice duck. <laughs> ah, that was the obvious stuff, but sometimes obvious works. Our Mishima is easier with controller or a stick. Most people will argue that. They are easier on stick. But I think they're just easier in general in Tekken 7. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Yeah, you compare like how easy they are in this game to like how more like much more difficult they were in previous Tekkens, it'll be like wow. Yeah. They've given them so many tools in this game. So, I think they're like the easiest they've ever been. But Violet, you're right, you're right. It's about your commitment. Round one. And that goes for any character. Fight. Nice. Oh, 
I don't know, break. You dodge Kazuya. <laughs> Yo, don't dodge people, man. Just play. Bro. He's Leroy Balance yet. He's still a S tier character, so. What's going on, Sportix? Gotta use those homing moves, raccoon. Get ready for the Was King the wrong starter? Yo, who's uh, trying to who's trying to brainwash Holy Gamer? <laughs> Oh man, who's trying to tell him King was a bad character to start with? Now King is a good character to start with. But honestly, I think whoever you like, just play with who you like. That's only that's only when it comes to optimizing completely. But you can definitely go the Chenzo route. That's what I always say. I recommend watching Chenzo if you want to see the most basic yet, you know. Effective thing, yeah, definitely watch him. Super effective, but simple. Oh, run up, down, forward, too. Yo, beauty, what's up? What's up? How's it going? Yo, that's actually a good kind of hit. Nice. Nice. Nice, nice. 
Yo, King Stick Show, thanks for the support, man. Thanks for the resub and your contributions to the chat earlier. Thank you. Oh goodness, what am I doing? Ah, oh, no break? Well, you better pick. Uh, oh well. You said we're not a wedding bells? I don't know, I don't know. We're, we're trying to um, plan it. Still in the early planning phase. Yo, that was actually pretty nice. Nice. Sometimes you just don't tick. I can have a rib. You guys talking about the other kings? Yeah, guys. The other kings are definitely worth watching. Because they don't all have the um, the same the stuff battle. that I have. You know, they don't use the same setups all the time. Some of them are better at certain matchups than I am. So yeah, it's definitely, definitely worth watching. Who would I pick if I just want to win? <laughs> Yo, Memphis Legends, I would probably say, I think Geese, I think Geese is like, Geese or like Devil Gen or something. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> nice. Round two. I didn't anyone. Good Armor King main streamer. You got Justin Iglesias. He's a pure Armor King. You better break that. Time up. Round three. Fight. Oh, I'm not breaking grabs anymore. Okay. Ah, oh, that was actually a punish. Good stuff, raccoon. Round four. Yeah, he's a real yeah. I play Armor King on the side. Dustin Iglesias. He's all about the armor king. 
All about them. Yo, really? A duck? That throw camera angle was nasty. No. <laughs> yeah, you can't get up trying to step against Armor King. You just duck. Is there setups to make camera angles hard like that? I don't know what you mean. They, they, some characters do have, yeah. Like Nina, she has a for real cross up with her core circle forward, uh, four, four, two. Where if you tech roll to the left, she like switches sides, the camera goes crazy, you get crossed up for it too. Like if you tech roll the wrong way, you actually get relaunched. So yeah, yeah, characters have that. Is that low? As a friend or some random now this is inconsiderate raccoon miracle. The tech and they get rid of rage, alright singing. And combo oh goodness. Combo breakers are Man, they not this game. Not this game. Let's get all this damage back. <laughs> Yo, Armor King's jabs are so whatever. <laughs> he sounds like short range they are. Round two. Fight. Nice. I'm trying to set up small Tekken, but Lol, that's like one of his best mids, so you know. Why not use it? Nice. You using armor king. Yeah, bro. I'm not using long. <laughs> Yo, I see y'all always try to real punish that. <laughs> That's a bummy setup. Oh, dude, I like big duck there. That's a big duck. Yeah, we just doing random stuff. Oh. <laughs> oh, geez, that hurt. Dang, that was it. That was it. But I brought it back. The King got nerfed. Now King, yeah, he did get some nerfs in season four, but 
the buffs outweigh the nerfs significantly. They just they just toned down his um ground throw damage. And it was some other meaningless nerf that really didn't matter much. Just make damage best across the board for taking eight. I agree with that, R run. Yeah, damage is way too high. Historically, damage in this game series has just been high. I think Tekken 4 was the only one where it wasn't such. Like, just one combo and you're either close to dead or, you know, more than half is gone. Yo, this man woke up and did that. I'm glad the combo dropped. Nice duck. <laughs> I could wake up magic with an attack too. When did you grow a martyr beard? <laughs> Unless you don't like that character. Wait, what? Who? Uh, Who? Uh, wait, lost lost jabs are bad. Do outstanding two one more time. I'm gonna show you why you shouldn't do it. Gonna show you why you shouldn't do it against the armor king. Fight. Wait, what's going on here? Well, raccoon, whatever you got going, I don't care what it is. Let's go. He's watching the clip. He don't care. <laughs> Yo, the show must go on, Raccoon. The show must go on. Yeah, because when you just sit there, I'm just going to kill you. So. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Yeah, that's another thing. A lot of you guys probably aren't. <laughs> Or probably haven't been to like tournaments. I say unless unless it's something that you can let slide, like a quick pause or something. If they like pause it on you by accident and it's quick. Yeah. They just sit there, their controller stops working and kill them. Round one. Fight. But yeah, some people are even more ruthless than that. They're like, I don't care. If you pause it, I'm taking the round. Yo. KO. Round two. Fight. You said it in rank? Yeah, real rank doesn't really matter. But I can understand if you take it. Yeah, go ahead. Wait, the rollback. KO. Yo, this got ducks. Who's that? Marcos? From Brazil? Hello, hello, hello. Oh yeah, I have to wait, wait, what?
Yeah, you can't afford to give Armor King any kind of punishment opportunities. That stuff hurts now. It's like kings. Yeah, what is up with that back dash? When is infinite stage better for you? DGs, you hate this game. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> GG's raccoon. Um, I don't. That's that's. He could not have rage quit. That was a that was a regular abnormality, right? Raccoon, you didn't just rage quit on me, did you? Because um, I know he didn't. Because it that was too that was too quick. Honestly, he plugged for real. I mean that was just you that 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 round was still winnable because I didn't get the wall carry. <laughs> that was a real rage oh well. You said no he didn't plug or the game just crashed. Whatever, it doesn't matter.